this is how many calories I burned. And this is where I'm sitting at as far as steps go for the day. And it is 1.31. So I met, well, I, su I superseded my goal of 10K steps because my goal is 10K steps a day. But more is always a plus. So steps for the day done. I'm about to go to the movies to see. I don't even know what it's called. The brand new movie. Can y'all see my outfit? about to see that movie with brandy i don't know what it's called the upper room something but um i don't know y'all i'm low energy right now but i'm vlogging i'm vlogging hi guys so yeah um yesterday we went to go see that movie the front room with brandy I wasn't impressed. It was a, it was a little plot twist at the end or whatever, but overall, I feel like the movie just made me, like, just irritated me. Like, I'm the type of person that I be having to remind myself while I'm watching a movie that it is a movie. Because you be like, well, why would that even happen? Well, how come she didn't do this? But it's like, girl, it's a movie. It's, it's not real life. It's a movie. So, if you tell yourself that it's a movie and you go in with an open mind you will probably enjoy it it wasn't the worst movie i've ever seen in my life by any stretch but wasn't impressed <laughs> um so i'm at work or whatever right now and then after work i'll probably do my walk outside i don't know I'll, i'm contemplating if i want to just go home and walk on a walking pad or walk outside i don't know whatever i do i'm only walking enough to get me to my 10k steps um yeah so that's it i just wanted to check back in and talk to you about that movie let me know in the comments if y'all saw it and what y'all thought about it and i will talk to y'all later so we were supposed to go to dollar taco night but it wasn't dollar tacos today so instead they cooked us some tacos even though she being mean over there right now she cooked us some tacos instead Don't mind my plate, y'all. One of my tacos broke because I couldn't open the shell. <clears throat> but we got shrimp tacos. And I have this sauce on there with ground turkey tacos. And it just got lettuce, cheese, and taco sauce. Good morning. So the day has finally come for me to get my hair done. I got something on there. It be so hard to keep this little stuff from off your locks and then it don't be it get on there and it don't wanna let go. Anyway, it is time. I know y'all can see this. It's time. I'm so excited to get my hair done. I really don't feel like sitting today. Like today is one of them days where I'm ready to get my hair done. It needs to be done. I should have dyed it. <laughs> I mean, I can always dye it later. But oh, look at that texture shot. My locks look good. They look good. But anyway, um, today is one of those days where I need my hair done and I want my hair done. 
but I don't feel like sitting and I don't feel like talking. Um, but you know, that's like a personal thing. So I'm not going to take my attitude in there. I don't really have an attitude. It's just one of those days. Like I just don't, I don't feel like being bothered. I wish that I could, um, I didn't do my 10 K steps yesterday. And then today, I don't know. I'm really not walking around that much. And so I'm going to have to get on the walking pad and walk. But I really want to reach my 10K steps today because one of my rules is to not miss um, more than a day. So I missed 10K steps yesterday. So today, realistically, I should be doing my 10K steps. But um, I'm going to be here for some time. It takes some time for me to get my hair um, done. It, I don't get my hair retwisted. I get it like retightened. It's like a interlocking method some people use a crochet needle but um that takes some time and then my lady which i this is why i like her so much is because she's thorough um it takes her a little bit longer um as opposed to if i go somewhere else i might be in and out quicker but last time i went somewhere else they forgot two of my locks um my parts don't be right they be having hair outside of my lock which I have um, small locks. I have micro locks. And um, if you don't have all the hair inside the locks, they can compromise the integrity of my lock. My lock is already small. So if you're going fast or not paying attention or not making sure that all the hair that's supposed to be in the lock is in the lock, they will cause my lock to thin over time. So um, she takes a little bit more time, but I know that my hair is going to be done right and then today might even take a little bit longer because the last time I got my hair done, I don't believe I came to her. Or did I? I feel like I didn't. So, um, yeah, she might have some repairs that she has to do also. Hold on, I'm getting a phone call. I'll be back. I'm back. I don't even know what I was saying. But uh, I think I was saying this. I don't feel like being social and talking. I really want to be able to be off today do my walk um i need to go to the market um i washed my clothes last night at bay house so i need to like fold my clothes and stuff like that but i'm not going to be able to just do my day how i want to do it because i have the hair appointment and that's okay because once my hair is done i'm gonna feel so much better because y'all uh i've been in a rut with my hair like i love my locks but i just been feeling like i need something different so like y'all know on my birthday i had did um i had added like the little curly hair on the end which super cute it was very time consuming it was super cute but when i was taking it out two or three maybe even four of my locks I took hair off of it like this much like that's this like a year worth of growth anyway so I won't do that again um I've been thinking about trying to do like some braids over my locks like some individuals but I'm not a braider so I'm gonna have to find like a little tutorial or something like that and maybe I can do that just to have like a change like um and also, I don't really be styling my hair either. Like, so maybe I'll start like trying to do different styles or styling my hair and it'll make me feel better. But like, yes, but I know that getting it done fresh is going to make me feel better. And then I'm going to dye it. When I got my fresh black dye, I'll be looking like a joint and I feel better. So, yeah, that's what I'm about to do now. And um, I don't know what I'm doing for the rest of the day. Uh... Yeah, and I kind of want some... I don't know what I'm eating later, y'all. I kind of want some crabs, but... I don't know. That's money. And baby, my money is funny right now. So... I don't know, but I'll be back and I'll talk to y'all later. So y'all can... I'll be back to show y'all my hair, definitely. At least. If, if not, you know, if nothing else, y'all gonna see when this hair is fresh. But do y'all see it? It's growing. Like, do y'all remember when I first started vlogging and my locks was like this? 
Like, look at this, y'all. Anyway, I'll talk to you later. Bye. In progress, y'all. Okay, lot. All right, y'all. So my hair is done. I know y'all see them crispy, crispy parts. I feel so much better. She did have to fix. Um, look at that, y'all. It's giving. It's giving. She did have to fix. Um. A lock she had to i had a lock that was really thin and she had to like marry it to a lock next to um it and then um just a few more things so i was there longer than usual and also it had been longer than usual in between my um i usually go I feel like I go every eight weeks. She said I go like every six weeks. So I'm just going to say I go between every six to like eight weeks. And so it had been like 10 weeks since I got my hair done. And I didn't see her the last time. So um, yeah, I was in there from like 10.45 to like 4.45, which is a very long appointment usually if i do 10 45 i'm out by like three but um that's neither here nor there the hair is done i still i have stuff that i need to do today but i don't know if i'm gonna do it um i need to run into the market but i don't think that's getting done and then obviously i didn't do my steps today but yeah it's five o'clock and i'm not even gonna worry about it to be honest like it is what it is life happens and this is a lifestyle change i'm not in a rush to lose weight i'd be having to tell myself that because like i am in a rush but i'm not in a rush like if it's going to be forever you can't be in a rush because you have to be able to maintain it during regular life and this is regular life essentially so, in regular life, things happen, and sometimes you aren't able to do your workout or whatever you plan, and that's just, it is what it is. So, I'm sitting here right now, um, waiting to meet up with Bay, and then figure out what we're going to eat for dinner or whatever. And I probably do, I probably will run in the store, but I probably just run in, like, Trader Joe's. I need to get, like, a few specific items, and I'll probably just get them out of there and then the rest of the stuff i'll need i'll do that i don't know maybe tomorrow or friday or shit even saturday because it is stuff in the house but i need i don't even want to really say i need stuff to take the work because i have something i i have something already there in the freezer that i can eat for lunch so I just need breakfast and I got something for breakfast in the house already. And then Friday, same. So that's what I'm doing now. Um, I kind of want to go to Longhorn, but I'm also open to trying something new. But Longhorn is near me and then Trader Joe's is right there. So they will kind of be easier for the convenience because then I still got to go in the house and fold these clothes. I don't even know if y'all can see my basket. I got these clothes back here that i still need to fold so yeah that's it but i'm happy that my hair is done and i'll talk to you all right y'all i saw this trend on tiktok going around where the pizza from pizza hut the pan pizza and you get philly steak um Oh, wait, let me start over. You get garlic parmesan sauce instead of marinara sauce, cheese, Philly steak. They had bacon on theirs, but I don't like bacon on my pizza. Um, and I got mushrooms. So, and I got me some marinara sauce on the side, but I'm going to try it and see if it's good. But I need to heat it up first. Like, it's not, I wanted it well done, but it wasn't an option to put that. So, I need mine as well done. So we're gonna put it in the oven. And then we also got some wings that we're gonna put in the oven too. 
And I'll come back and tell y'all how it tastes. Y'all, I didn't even tell y'all what happened to me and why I have worn glasses. So, I had one pair of contacts left. I'm putting lotion on my face this morning. The contact falls out my eye, lands I don't know where, and then here we are wearing glasses. Anybody who knows me knows <laughs> that I don't like to wear glasses. I have worn contacts since I've been in the ninth grade. I am well past the ninth grade at this point. And why when I got to work, and why when I got to work, <laughs> my baby mom gonna say, my son's mom gonna say, not my baby mom, my son's mom. Well, I guess that would be my baby mom. Anyway, she gonna say, you look smart. And I said, oh my God. I said, oh my God, that's what Bay says. <laughs> and she was like, I know, that's why I said it. And we just bust out laughing. Cause I guess at some point I had told her that, but I didn't remember telling her that. And then she, anyway, y'all, I got on glasses, but I feel like every time y'all see me, I'm eating. I'm also drinking this little drink. It's like a pre-made drink. I'll show y'all the container. It's okay. It tastes strong though. Don't you like it? I drink liquor and I get it from the liquor store. <laughs> anyway, I'll be back, y'all. All right, this is the pizza more well done. Um, the wings still in the oven. We gotta check them. I'm gonna try. So it's the pan pizza with garlic parm instead of marinara, cheese, Philly cheese, Philly steak, mushroom, and sausage. And I don't know if y'all know, but I'm a marinara girl, so I got some marinara to dip mine in. Like, why you can't have some of this? Why can't you Because I didn't know you want money, but why you can't have some of this? You just messed up my whole little swag. Anyway, um, so I'm going to try it by yourself first. Wait, you better don't say nothing. They did not cut this pizza. Like, they were scared to cut it. Look. Oh, my goodness. I can't even break it apart. All right, y'all, they barely cut it, so it's hot. My piece of sausage, bro. All right, so this is it with no marinara first. It's good. What you think about it? I like it. You would prefer the tomato sauce? I'm and I just tried it with the blue cheese and with the zesty ranch. You know what I'm trying? Both so, what you think about it with, um, like, just like this? Would you get this or do you feel like I you need it? It's giving, it's giving reminiscent of um, cuts and slices. All right, so this with the marinara sauce. I like that better. With the marinara? Mm -hmm. So, if I get this, I would get, make sure I get marinara on the side. Because mm -hmm. I still want that marinara flavor. But also, y'all, they have Alfredo sauce. And some people in the comments of the TikTok video I saw said the Alfredo sauce is better than the garlic parm. So next time we get pizza from Domino's, who knows when, we'll try the Alfredo sauce. But my verdict is, I feel like I just started yelling, <laughs> that I like it. I will get it again. I like it. By itself too. Well, all the sauce. Yeah, I like it by itself too. But this just elevates it to me. But right, I'm about to bust me on. Um, this is the I'm gonna show y'all the container for the drink that I'm drinking. And then I'll talk to y'all later. So this is the drink. This the wings, y'all. And I got buffalo sauce and ranch. But all right, mm, I'm about to tear this food down. So y'all, I forgot there wasn't even the end of Big Bag Activities. So another TikTok I saw was about these brown butter chocolate chunk cookies from Whole Foods. So I went and got me and Bae some so we can try it. It's They come in like four jumbo cookies 
or he said 18 mini cookies and i didn't need 18 so we just got the four jumbo ones but yeah so we want to bake these and try these we'll let you know how they are but yeah this ain't the end of the big big activities so <laughs> this is how much i paid for the four cookies and um and my whole foods i had to go to like the bakery part and ask them for these but on tiktok i saw other people like um theirs was just already out in the refrigerated section so if you go in your whole foods and you can't see it out just go to the bakery and ask them so yeah all right all right the cookies didn't come with directions so the video i saw said she baked hers at 350 for 15 minutes um i didn't have a cookie sheet so i baked mine at 350 but i did like 17 to 18 minutes i like my cookies done but still soft so also you're supposed to let them sit for 30 minutes so i'll let y'all see them when we about to eat them but this is what they looking like straight out the oven yo that pizza got me feeling sick my stomach hurts. So I'm at home, about to walk y'all. I have on my weighted vest. I think it's like 15 pounds in here right now. Five, I think it's five, ten. No, it's 20 pounds in here right now. Um, it goes all the way up to 40, but it's heavy. So I got on my weighted vest. Um, and then I got on my little ankle weight. Y'all can't see it. But I'm just walking in the house today because um i don't know if i put that clip in because it was music playing in the background but that pizza last night had messed up my stomach um so i haven't had anything this morning and i do want to get my steps because i have not gotten my 10k steps in, in the past three days just being transparent y'all um because real life happens um so i do want to get my 10 cups day my 10 cups day I do want to get my 10k steps in today, but I want to make it a little bit harder, so that's why I'm going to wear the weighted vest. Also, the weighted vest has some health benefits. If you want to learn more about weighted weighted vest health benefits, Google it, you guys, and you might want to add a weighted vest to some of your walks. It's also called rucking. I think that's what they call it. But anyway, so. I'm home. I'm about to do that now. I still can't fit my waist trainer, y'all. I still can't fit the other waist trainer. But right now I'm at. Can y'all see that? Five hundred fourteen oh eight. And let's see where we at when we finish. I don't know if I'm gonna do ten k on the treadmill, but I'm definitely gonna get to ten k today. Y'all gonna hold me accountable, so I'll come back before the end of the day. And show y'all where I'm at. I'll also just come back at the end of the workout and show y'all where I'm at. I wish I could walk outside, but I'm scared. My stomach is unpredictable. Since I'm in the house, if it start rumbling, I can go to the bathroom. If I'm walking outside, that's going to be an issue. Um, but yeah, I just feel like it goes quicker when you're outside. When you're inside, it feels like you're walking. Um, so I'm about to watch this little documentary on Netflix. I don't even know from already from the beginning. I don't even know if I'm feeling it. I'm gonna give it another chance. It's called Into the Fire, the Lost Daughter. So I'm gonna do that while I'm walking. And yeah. So decided to come get some crabs. Yeah. So. This is where my steps are at for today. I did good. I hit 10K, 10K steps and beyond. Um, so I just wanted to come back and show y'all. I also made some shrimp, but they remixed it and put, what's the sauce? Honey buffalo. A honey buffalo sauce on. I didn't even show y'all the- That I made from scratch. I didn't even show y'all the regular shrimp when it was just fried. Was they good, babe? They was delicious. So I'm about to try the honey buffalo and weigh in all right so oh they hot still too sweet you know i'm a sweet girl you a salty girl go <laughs> <laughs> you can give an honest opinion i'm gonna i'm my honest opinion it's tastes good it tastes like the name honey buffalo it's good. Okay. 
y'all. So I never came back and showed y'all my crabs, but they was good. They was just small and they was female crabs and I prefer male crabs, but I mean, they tasted, they tasted good. Um, it is some left. So today, um, when I go home, I'll just show y'all what they ended up looking like, I guess. But I'm so mad I didn't um, remember to record the crabs. And also, <laughs> I didn't ever come back and tell y'all how the cookies was from Whole Foods. They were good. Um, I just feel like they needed to be in the oven a little bit longer. Bae said she liked them, but I feel like they was too soft in the middle for me. But, um... They were good, like the flavor of the cookie was, was good. She said she didn't think that they were that sweet. I felt like they were sweet. Um, but she is also a sweet person and I'm more of like a savory person or a salty person. So they were sweet enough for me. Um, would I get them again? Yes, on a special occasion because one cookie I think is like 400 calories. So it's not really practical for what I'm trying to do right now, but of course you you can always treat yourself. So it's not it's not time I would do all the time, but it was good and I would definitely um get it again. But yeah, that's it. I think I'm gonna wrap up the vlog right here. Um, it's Sunday and I'm actually on my way to work right now. This is my Sunday to work. Ooh, tomato, tomato, tomato. Oh, excuse me. Um, but yeah, I think I'm gonna end the vlog right here. If you made it this far, leave a flower in the comments. And I will see you guys on the next one. As always, thank you for watching. Please remember to like, comment, and subscribe.